What's up everyone? Today is Monday, July 28th at 8.40 a.m. Gonna do a video watch list today. Uh, so a couple things to make note of is number one, I do a free video watch list every single Monday on YouTube. And every other day I do a video watch list for the members inside MIC. Um, so what I kind of want to talk about today is Monday morning FOMO. Uh, what I've noticed about this market lately is that there's a lot of crazy runners pre-market on Mondays because everyone has so much FOMO after the weekend. And I've also noticed that on Fridays we have the most amount of zombie moves that have been happening. So I'm going to kind of keep that on watch as well. All right, so let's get started. Um, BOXL is number one. So this is a stock that kind of finally had its topping day here and then had its kind of fading day yesterday, I mean on Friday. <coughs> Excuse me. As you can see, high, lower high, lower high, lower high. On a scenario like this, what I'm looking for is I'm looking for either a push towards this 350, looking to scale towards 370. Uh, but ideally, you know, the big, big uh, level that I'm looking at is 380 and kind of $4. So on something like BOXL, I will scale uh, some at 350, I will scale some at 370. If 375 breaks, I will get out for a small loss and wait for 380s and four. But on something like this, hopefully we get an SSR bounce and then a fade. Um, I think they released a $150 million S3, AKA an offering, uh, but I think it needs effect. So probably until it gets the effect, it's gonna have random PRs, it's gonna have random this, random that. So be very careful with it. Be quick, nail and bail. Don't really uh, overstay your welcome. TNXP, um, this is a stock that I've traded in the past, kind of like a former runner, but every time it gets volume, kind of pulls back. Uh, as you can see over here, 130 was resistance, and no surprise, 130 was resistance today as well. So in a perfect world, I'm looking for a pop towards 120 and 130 in the morning to short. Uh, just gonna keep it really simple. IMRN, IMRN, I wasn't really interested in this stock. Um, until I saw it top out at 15 and then started to kind of fade. So what I'm looking for on this stock is looking for a pop towards 13, 14 to short. Uh, if this kind of just washes out under 11, I will look to bounce it towards 12 and 12.50. So ideally just waiting for this to kind of show its trend, but it looks like it's gonna fail pre-market so far. Don't wanna get in, don't wanna anticipate. Let it tank and I'll be there on the bounce. Uh, DPW, this is the potential hot chick of the day. Probably a big chat room pump target. Obviously there's resistance here in the fives, but honestly I'm not looking to attack this pre-market. Not looking to get cute at it at all. Uh, I see some support here at $4, so probably when this breaks $4, it's game over. But what I would like to see personally is I wanna see it wash out towards this 420s level, try to bounce towards 450, 460, 470, and short that bounce. Again, I am not attacking front side. I'm not attacking strength. I am waiting for the stock to top out first, and then I will attack. Um, RMBL. I was actually really interested in this stock uh, as it was pumping, again, being pumped up pre-market towards like 30 bucks. Uh, but now my game plan is very simple, looking to short a pop towards red to green, which kind of coincides with the pre-market VWAP level. So hopefully we get a pop there. This was a crazy ass runner, uh, kind of trapped everyone at zombie times and then boom. So this always goes back to the same thing that if you leave around zombie times and come back around reversal times, you know, there's opportunity there, but best to just avoid zombie times. Last but not least, a low hanging fruit, FTFT, uh, just looking for a pop towards three, nothing crazy. So again, guys, today's Monday. Uh, I'm gonna do a YouTube live at 11 o'clock today. Um, also, uh, we're gonna release some more information on our second annual event coming up. Uh, so stay tuned for that. And that's it guys. So thank you all for watching. Uh, I do a secret word at the end of the videos to make sure that you guys are watching. Today's secret word is gonna be Monday. Uh, so I'll see you guys in the room and good luck today.